<laughs> I'm super duper duper excited today. Uh, if you watched yesterday's vlog, we're supposed to be in Colombia today, but we didn't make our flight and we missed our flight yesterday. So, round two again today. We're flying on JetBlue and apparently there's only one flight that goes from Florida to Colombia. So, we're gonna be leaving at the same time tonight, which gives us a whole entire day today to get caught up, hang out with friends, and do whatever we please. So right now, we're about to go have brunch and go meet up with some friends. <laughs> Getting ready for Colombia. Well, what do we have here? Donde Adela. About to eat some Colombian food before we head to Colombia. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, well. Who do we who do we have here again? Who who do we have here again? <laughs> so those of you guys that don't know. Jennifer is Colombiana. We have very few Colombian friends, but Jennifer is one of them. Yes. Yeah, these are called buñuelos, uh, traditional um, bread, Colombian bread. Sweet. They're made out of uh, special flour with uh, cheese and milk. And these ones here are called almohadas. They are made with flour, special flour, but three types of flour with uh, cheese. Awesome. There's more cheese than flour on this one. That's the biggest tamale I've ever seen. Oh, <laughs> right here. Wow. Dang. Like a present. Some uh, paisa. I forgot what it's called. Ayako. Man, this looks good. Bon appetit, guys. Enjoy. I love hanging out with my friends, especially Alazar and Jennifer, because they just know how to make us laugh. We laugh so much when we're hanging out with those guys. They're so much fun. Love you guys. All right, here at my pop's house, about to hang out with my pops and my sister and my nephew. Got to do some family time before the trip. Lily's hanging out with her family too. Yeah, Say, I love Uncle David. <laughs> He's being shy. Said it? No, he didn't say it. Do you love Uncle David? You want to see the drone fly? Yeah? You want to see it? Let's go check out the drone. Baby's first time seeing the drone. Can you say drone? Can you say drone? <laughs> Here yeah. with my pops. Mom. And my sister and baby. Give me baby look. Hi, yeah, hi, David. We're taking the drone for a flight. My dad's never flown a drone before. Have you ever flown a drone, Dad? Uh, Have you ever flown no, a drone no, before? No. no? Alright, here, let's go. We're gonna let him fly. Let's see what happens. <laughs> He's all into it. <laughs> yeah. Drones bring people together. Look at my dad. He's having so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> You like the drone? <laughs> my sister Jackie taking the drone for her first flight. How is it? So fun. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Right, we've had a lot of friends ask us, what the heck are you guys packing? How do you guys pack so light? What are you guys bringing? Here's a behind the scenes look at exactly what we're bringing. Two backpacks, one for equipment and camera gear, and the second backpack is being shared between me and Lily for all of our clothes for over 30 days. Here we go. 
and I'm not happy about it. All right, so this is all the stuff in backpack number one, all the camera and all the electronics. Let's start off with this right here. It's a GoPro tripod. Then we got the GoPro 3, the GoPro 4, all the GoPro accessories. I'm gonna go on the details what's in there. It's all these mounts and thumb screws diving filters and a ton of other stuff. Extra batteries for this camera right here. Total four batteries. Then we got the dual charging port, the one singular charging port, tactical pen. DJ Osmo right here, this is where you get to see those really nice cinematic 4K shots that I shoot with. It's a great, tiny, compact travel camera just for that purpose. This is a mount for that camera that allows it to stand. Got the media transfer file devices here, an external battery so we can charge our devices on the go. We use USB, extra Gorilla tripods for the GoPro, one for the phone, camera lens cleaning stuff. Got our laptops. This is what I use for some small editing and to check on stuff for work. Uh, Lily's laptop, chargers for that, our mouses, Lily's iPad. Two phones, one is dedicated for the drone and one is actually dedicated for the DJI Osmo. So that's there. Extra batteries for the phones, charging plugs, earbuds, USB cables for that. Then we got the drone itself, the GDI 4. Got three batteries, these are two extra, okay? Three batteries, so total flight time for about an hour and a half if they're fully charged. The RC charger for that, extra blades, lens caps, polarizers, filters, and all of this is going into this backpack. So that is everything you saw into this backpack. This thing is, oh my gosh. Woo. This thing is definitely like 25 pounds at least. Here we go, there it is. And that's backpack number one. Let's show you backpack number two. Now for backpack number two, this is David's clothes and you'll see it's very limited. I literally have two pairs of shorts, two swimming shorts, okay, some underwear, some basketball shorts, three tank tops, emergency kit in there, medicine for like, you know, if you get diarrhea, if you get a headache, a fever, I mean, all sorts of stuff. It has like bandages for cuts and bruises. It's a really, really cool travel kit. It has like everything you can pretty much think of. And that's it for me. And I have this little cube that you stuff it into. So it's nice and organized. All right, this is Lily's. I have three pairs of yoga pants. They're right here. Three bathing suits, which is not much. And I have a few pair of underwear, four or five shirts, and one dress. I have four pair of shorts. So she brought a lot more clothes than me. Okay, included in uh, some other stuff, we have our hats. One, two for me, and then the one I'm wearing, so three. Lily's gonna have two hats as well. These are like my uh, running shoes, swimming shoes, hiking shoes. I mean, they're very versatile, and I love these because they're, they're flat, you know? Uh, you can, they're waterproof, it's really awesome. And then I'll be wearing sandals. Lily has sandals and one pair of shoes. That's it. I know ladies are watching this going, oh my gosh, that's all she's bringing for shoes? Yes. This is our bathroom kit. It has our toothbrushes, deodorants, Lily's glasses are in here and a bunch of other potions and lotions and stuff. And this is Lily's makeup bag. This whole bag is dedicated to makeup. That's it for Lily. And that's it. That goes in backpack number two. Couple of other things we forgot to mention. These are sunglasses. We got four pairs. Lily's wearing one. And our vitamins. Can't forget those. And I think that's everything. That's everything we're bringing for 30 days. Okay, so that's how I travel. Anyone, friends or family that travel with me, they have to travel light because I hate having too much stuff that slows you down. Traveling light is the key to success when you're traveling. You have to do it, you know? So, um, you know, you figure, oh my gosh, what if I need this or what if I need that? Well, whatever it is that you think you need, it's not like you're going to a country that doesn't have it. You can always buy things there. So seriously, you just gotta leave all that other crap at home. Forgot to also mention these two little travel pillows we bring with us. These are freaking awesome. They're a lifesaver sometimes. They inflate with just air. 
and it blows up to like a nice size pillow and you can inflate or deflate them to the right pillow pressure our sleeping mask with a little pocket for earbuds and uh, yeah that's it this is our kit that goes into the bag that helps us sleep on the plane or sometimes at a noisy hotel or whatever but this thing is awesome and I think that's everything here it is this thing actually is a backpack slash a carry-on the reason why let me show you guys check this out guys it has wheels and a little compartment here pulls out and you can use it as a carry-on it's really nice now let's say you want to use it as a backpack these pull out and that's a backpack <laughs> little girl big backpack look at that see that one's probably about 15 <laughs> 15 pounds. So how's it feel, honey? Does it feel comfortable? Yeah. It's feel yeah. Good. So that's it. That's all we're bringing. Are you excited? No. <laughs> all right, round two. We're going to Colombia. <laughs> Seriously, we're not going to miss our flight this time. It is 7:55. Got to be at the airport at 7:40. Plenty of time. I think we're good. This is really clever. Look what Lily did for the plants. Water me, please, once every two weeks. That's so smart. <laughs> Just a cool reminder. Alright, I'm a little bit, just a little bit upset right now. We just checked the flight status and it's delayed by an hour. If this would have happened yesterday, everything would have been good. We're like so on time, we're super early and now it's delayed. Go figure, right? One of the saddest parts about leaving is saying bye to these guys. We were such in a rush yesterday, we didn't even get a chance to say bye to them. So we have more time today. Let's do an official goodbye. Be a good girl. Be a good girl. Be a good girl, okay? Be a good boy, Ratchet. Be a good boy. Be a good boy. Be a good boy. Be a good boy. All right, here's the update. It's 9.30 p.m. Our flight leaves at 11.40. We are more than on time this time. Thanks for the lift. Thanks for the lift again, bro. <laughs> Thank you. Why are you laughing at me, Lily? <laughs> tell, them, tell them what happened. You ran into the door, almost hit your face. It was a glass door and I was Snapchatting. I wasn't paying attention. I went boom. <laughs> this hat saved me, actually, because I literally went boom. <laughs> Dangerous. <laughs> Do not Snapchat and walk at the same time. <laughs> Stop laughing at me. Stop laughing at me. <laughs> it's about to go down. We're super excited. <laughs> Here we go. 